we're back to with fears to fathom and this episode we are going to be doing the Norwood hitchhike we're just gonna get started with it because I don't give a shit <laughs> Fears to Fathom, Episode 2, Norwood Hitchhike, June 16. <clears throat> this happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help, even just a little bit. I was one of those people that loved gaming conventions. I go every con I go to every convention. I get the chance <laughs> convention. I get the chance to, and sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going to interstate on interstate drives. But a plane ticket would have been too expensive. I can tell you that. I'm literally flying. I literally want to fly somewhere. And it's going to be freaking expensive to do that. So yeah, I can, I can give from experience. Yeah, it's really expensive. This convention I went to, I went, went at was, went great. And... It was now the day to drive back home. But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided to take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over a 12 hour drive. Oh shit! Oh, we can actually drive? I don't. I don't, driving at night was really therapeutic for me. I don't know if that music was copyright. It was, well, well, at least it used to be. Sorry, Aiden, I can't, I can't read your messages. I'm too busy driving. What, you want me to die? I'm so good at this. Whoa! Push! Oh, Dad, I cannot read your text messages. I'm driving. I'll do it when I stop. Actually, can I escape? Can I get out of the vehicle? space to get out I guess I can just read the text messages I guess I can just read the text messages like in the middle of the road I could but I feel like there's gonna be a thing that I can go do I don't know I just have that feeling cuz like it won't just be like a nighttime drive like that would be like a weird game. If it was just the nighttime drive and things happen. I don't know. I don't I don't make games. Oh shit. You're halfway through the drive I realized I was low on gas. Oh shit. So obviously there's gonna be like a gas station. Dad, I can't read your messages right now. Uh, 
I just saw that. What is this? What the f fuck? Whoa! Yeah, I'll just park there. Just screw it. Alright, I'm... Uh, screw you, Dad. I'm gonna read my friend's... thing. Discord? We got ticks. So, I'll see the I'll see if I can get the car. I'll let you know. I'm finally going to the mi mi mil mil take mill on a walk. Lol, arrow lol. Okay, the plan is on. Hell yeah. Wait, you're getting the car? Yep, big girl. I sure you sure Ash can't come. I'll get the skateboard too. Saw this really cool skate park nearby. Sounds fun. Discord? Where are you? Almost there. I don't see you. That's why. I don't see why. Peacher. It was fun. I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Smiley face with a double chin. Again, you sure are driving all the way back? I don't really have a choice now, do I? You could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you reach back to your cave. Okay, Dad. Not sure if this is a lifetime. This is the lifetime, though. What do you mean? Stuck in the biggest traffic jam in the country. That sucks. It's not too good here either. I think the people from the convention. I think it's the people from the convention. That's it. I'm rerouting here. You gotta do what you gotta do. All right, now let's talk to Dad. You called. Yeah, I think I'm going to t go into that convention. Can I get a car for like five days? Can I get your car for like five days, please? With who? Aiden. That internet friend? He's a nice guy. No. You're not driving it. You're not going on a 10 hour drive by yourself. Well, I've already made up my mind. I'll drive you. Why don't you understand anything? Let's talk when I get home. Drive safe, Holly. Don't forget to call me. You got it, Dad. What is this? Aiden William. Anything else? Leaving now. Drive safe, Holly. Where did you reach? Still about six hours away from the city. And I stuck in a jam. Told you to take that flight. Oh, Holly. It's gonna be late when you reach back. I hope you're feeling alright. Alright, well my car is probably out of gas. Because I'm literally just standing here reading test messages. So my car is probably most likely out of gas, but I need a drink. I didn't want it. <laughs> I was long. I was too low on cash for that. Wasn't feeling it. Didn't want it. He'll eventually take it. <laughs> All right. My car is just out there. Ready to be burglarized. Alright, so I'm inside of a supermarket. Or, like a little... Mom. Hey, it takes my mom. Holly. Mom. <laughs> Cola. What? If I... If I don't want one... Then why the fuck did I, why did I just say out there I didn't want one, but then in here I'm just like, you know, I kind of feel like having it. But I need gas, so, oh, hello. How's your day going? Where are you heading? How's your night going? He just looked at me. Where are you going? Damn, you got an ass!
Um, We're heading. He just looked at me. I mean, you're an ass. I I'm probably gonna need some gas, so I'm just gonna. Ma'am. Oh, so I'm a woman. Okay. Hi, hey, it's ten ten on pump two. Okay. You heading you heading to the bridge by your by yourself? The bridge? Yes, why? The bridge? The Norwood Valley Road, I mean. Not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Be careful. What do you mean? For about a century, not many people have been going missing down there. I cool. And one more thing. Okay, what, what, man? If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just step on the gas as hard as you can. Okay. Whatever you do, never, ever, under any circumstance, pick up a hitchhiker. Okay, okay, okay. Pump two. My car is parked a little too far first. Bitch! It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Damn it, I'm stuck. I'm blocked in. I fucked up big time. Man, I suck at driving. Just look at my Grand Theft Auto 5 playthrough. Alright, is that good? Is that good? <laughs> Apparently that's good! I filled the tank and I was off to the road again. Filled up. I didn't get to hear what that man said. All I know is that don't, under any circumstances, pick up a hitchhiker. My mom asked to buy some from, from my little at the store. So I'm going back in there. I guess I can talk to that man again, I guess. See what he really had to say. What did she say? Mom, I don't know if you'll find any shop at this hour, but... We're out of dog food. Could you get some for Milo? Milo? I'll pay you back. Sure, Mom. You hear about the neighborhood valley monster? 
Huh? Never mind. You're a weird guy. You're weird. Huh. So dog food. Where's the dog food at? You got you got pump two. Thanks. I want to know where the dog food's at. If there even is any here. I chose low quality, but <laughs> it's honestly kind of hard to see anything. Beep. It's not what I want. Anything else, ma'am? Look, I don't know where to find dog food. All this stuff is... Meat snack, chocolate, drink soda, want to drink, can I buy it? And soon? But where's the dog food? <laughs> I want to know. Oh, is this it? It'll be five dollars, ma'am. Pay. I hope that's dog food. I mean, there's a dog on it, so I, I assume. I should just put that in the trunk. And this is confusing. What the freaking balls? How do I put it in the trunk? Do I just... <laughs> eh. Is that good? No? Is that good? <laughs> oh, I guess I'll take it. Bro, how do I put something in the back of the trunk? There you go. That's good. That's good. Oh, that's good. All right, now I'm on my, uh, now I'm back on the road. Back on the road. It's fucking bright. God, I am a reckless driver. <laughs> the thing monsters do truly do exist and every single one of them looks like looks just like you and me oh a person Mo you know what fuck it You're not expired or anything right no mom <laughs> I just had to quickly text my mom while I was driving kids don't do this it's it's bad it's a bad influence What the f Why are the lights off again? <laughs> I can honk the horn. Oh shit, am I going down a hill? Woohoo! I always do that when I go down hills. I put my arms up like it's a roller coaster and just have fun. What the fuck? So I guess I'm just on the road, I guess. Bro, what the f Bro. Bro, I can't see.
Bro, I can't see. Am I gonna drive like this? I don't wanna die. Speed limit is 30. I, I would go with the speed limit, but I can't see Jack Dilly squat. Bro, I can't see. But what the f ah! I I admit I'm a I was a terrible driver. Yep. Well, I mean, it's not my fault. I fucking can't see. When it's pitch black and it's nothing but static on the screen, I can't do much about that, can I? Wait, sure, why does I feel like I'm going fast? Where am I going? Bro, I this is hard. I can't freaking If you guys don't know, I don't I don't drive. I can't drive right now. So I can only stick to games. And this is hard. What's the speed limit? I can't see, it's too bright! So, I guess we're just driving on the road. Following the speed limit, doing all this shit. Oh, we're on the bridge. Oh, we're on the bridge. What the fuck? I saw that. There was a person just standing up there. It was like a naked person. <laughs> like you had to go skinny dipping or something. What the f fuck? This is weird. Where am I at now? Am I not A beautiful moon. It's nice. There's a very lot of weird things about the night. Whoa! Thought I could drive past the logs, but it just wouldn't budge. I not much of it at the time.
All right, well, I... My car wouldn't start back up. That's weird. Whoa. Might need to stop. We was that? stranded in the middle of nowhere with no phone service. Wait, what? No, so... Fuck! <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have said that to mom. I'm not saying that I was starting to believe whatever the bullcrap at the gas station was, but... I feel like it's slight of, of an ease. Uh, can I fix it? I don't mean to make it sound like a cliche horror story, but... But what? Throughout my life, I was told not to take rides from strangers, but at the moment, I had no choice. I was scared to think how long it would be before someone passed. Ten twenty three PM Huh Oh shit Fuck Understand how somebody, um, this is the same time. I'm just gonna stand here, stand my ground. Yo, bitch! I just got ran over, and I just I'm I'm perfectly fine. Okay. You're the girl from the gas station. I didn't think anyone was gonna stop for me here. What are you trying to do out? What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. I can't call for help. There's no phone service. You think I can get a ride? Where are you heading to? Just up the road. To the nearest stop where I can call for help. Just a near stop. Hop in. Thank you so much. Could you wait until I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the back. I won't be. I won't be here for too long. All right. Oh jeez. Do I have to do this all manually? Bitch just ran me over, and I'm perfectly fine with getting into a car with him. And I'm a woman. Oh, obviously the dog food. I only have two hands. Ugh, why do you have to park so far away? I'm just gonna... <laughs> Fuck. Come on. Pick it up. I can't leave it. <laughs> I guess I'm leaving it. There we go. Ha! Oh shit. Ha! Oh yeah. 
Hold up, sir. I'm, I'm, I'm so close. I'm close to getting all my stuff. Is it okay if I have a dead body? <laughs> you need to hurry up. Don't have all day. Let me get my stuff. I'm done. Finally. Now hop, hop in. Be quick. Thank God, can you drive? Well, this is um awkward. So So you won't tell me who you are, where you're going. I'd rather not say if that's okay. I really live close from you. I was driving home. And that piece of crap broke down on me. Jason? What? My name's Jason. Okay. It's me, Jason. I would say my name's Holly, but I don't trust you, bitch! Hopefully you can't hear me, because I know that the other game. You're really lucky I had to be on this side of the town tonight. I must say, you are one brave young woman. Was, was that? How's that? You got any clue what happened to your car back there? I think it was the battery. It's an old car. I don't know. It never broke down on me like that ever before. It's my dad. It's pretty old. I mean, you're a creep, bruh. I mean, I don't want to say that, but just in case there's a uh, voice activation. Because and I know in uh, the other one there was voice activation. In Home Alone there was voice activation, so I don't know if there's voice activation in this one. So... Do you think about getting about what I told you back on the ga back at the gas station? I didn't listen to a single word. You really creeped me out. Uh, he really creeped me out. Interesting. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. LB, LMB to talk. So is it true? What, the monster? Let's see. I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are... There are some things. And I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. Hey, listen. I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them. You don't bother them. And don't and you don't be bothered. That's uh interesting. That's interesting. Can I look at your ass? Oh, hello. You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. Hmm. Yeah, you kind of creep me out, bro.
12.08 a.m. After a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Apparently, they offered roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful. There are all kinds of people out there, he said ominously before leaving. Bye, bud. I love you. Okay, I'm at a motel now. <laughs> what does that say? Oh, Jesus. Hi, sir. Man, putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Yeah. I don't like this one bit. It's the same picture! Alright. Gal, need a room to shake up for the night? How much is, is, is it for a room? Um, yes, I'm only going to be here for a few hours. Yes. 40 for a single. Pay cash only. Pay? I thought I said I was running low on money. Room number nine, over he over, right over there. Talk about the car. 90 bucks. Tommy will take care of the next thing in the morning. Then Pay? What the fu- Good. I'll let Tommy know. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. Well, okay, weirdo. Right over there. Room number nine. Is It is. Uh, I hate you already. Bitch. I thought I didn't have much money. Yeah, I just spent straight up like a hundred... Basically, what was it, 130? I just spent like 130 plus that other drink I got, which was like a dollar. So I, I just spent like dollar and 31. Oh, plus the dog food that was like 10 bucks or four. Oh, 10 for gas. And then four for the dog food. How much money do I got? I said I didn't have much in the beginning when I was wanting a drink. What the fuck? Number two, that's not my room. I don't want to wake the other people, so I'm just gonna... Number three, that's not my room. Number four... So it's probably over here. Five... Six... Oh, seven, eight, nine. It's over here, right there. Holly. Hey, where are you? Hey, where are you at? Dead. Not delivered. I may stay at a motel tonight. Where'd you reach? Why are you not picking up? Um, uh, don't think talking out here. Actually, you no. Know fuck it. Aiden. That's where I'm rooting you. Hey, where are you at? Your dad's calling me. I'll be right, Dad. Hey, where did you reach? Why are you not picking up my call? What do you mean, reroute? Dad, I may have to sit in a motel tonight. Surprisingly, there was dog food at a gas station, but don't need to don't need to pay me for it. It's not expired or anything, right, Holly? Oh well, this is uh, awkward. Number nine. That's my room. It's nice and warm inside. Ooh. There's a smell of a musky smell. You got it from an old house. Can I lock the door? Shit. Okay. There's, there's some flowers. That's a. Uh... Whoa. Superman Paramount presents Ooh Can I actually want to watch this? I heard a noise Oh what the f what the fuck? Couldn't have 
couldn't have slept there. When do I... Bro, why does it do that? What the fuck? It's voice activated. Bro, this is weird. Bro, I don't like that. Oh, Jesus! What are you doing here? You scared the crap out of me! <laughs> Who are you? I'm Tommy, room service here at Roadway Inn, the finest stopover in Norwood. What are you doing in there? You know, cleaning stuff. You got the front desk, gave me this room. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just get my stuff. Where's my stuff? <laughs> it's in my car, right? Oh, there's my stuff. I really need some energy soda. I literally had one, like, not too long ago. Granted, Time did pass, so I guess it's a little gift that we needed. Wait, can I just can I can I use this, bro? I would knock on the door, but I don't want to wake anyone up. Thanks, bro. I'm just gonna destroy your hard work. Had a word with Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. And also, the room's phone is not working if need anything. Just ask for the front, just ask at the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. <laughs> but you have, you have a good night. Man, you're a buff man. Can you be my husband? Cause you got the at. You better shut me out of my own freaking door. I'm gonna talk to you again. I don't know, but you're buff. I like you. I like you. What the hell is that? Ugh, I have to. Grab all my stuff. It's gonna be. Whoa, bro! You almost ran me over. Jeez. Talk about what's with these people these days. What's with you? Goddamn. Oh God, I hate that picture. I put it on my bed. I put it on my bed because you know. Right. Now I'm just gonna like throw it on the floor because I need to sleep on this bed. I'm just gonna throw this on the floor. Go to bed right now with the door wide open. I wasn't gonna. What I was gonna do is I was going to close the door. And I have to go talk to the front desk because I probably have to get my mom and dad on the phone. Tell him I'm staying in a motel just in case he doesn't get the car fixed and I just wasted money and then I'll be stranded forever. You have a great night's sleep. 
Where's the... Where's the phone? Where's the phone? You bitch lied to me? Oh, that asshole. Oh, I thought that was a person. I was like, I was like, what the fuck? That asshole. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Didn't I say I wanted an energy drink? Actually, what, how does the bathroom look? Or is this the bathroom? Wow, there's nothing. Oh, the toilet. The this place is haunted. Make sure no one's in the closet. Because apparently there's something that I have to hide in there for. Alright. Let me just... Yo, what the fuck? Call foresight, but there was... Something was very off about this place. Bro, I saw that. There was someone at my... Fucking window. She feeling that something wasn't right. A cup of coffee. What? The tub still isn't loaded in. That's that's good. That's that's great. Oh, there's the phone. Oh God! Turn that off. Turn that off, bro. Still no service. It's something about coffee. Cappuccino. I like cappuccino. Is it free? Consume. Alright. What the fuck? Dead? Bro, I... Bro... Head to bed. What the fuck was that? Was that cappuccino drugged? I swear to God, that wasn't me. Three eighteen a.m. Ooh, witching hour. I was seated. What the fuck?
Who is it? Draw from the front desk. Open the door. Then I specifically tell you to not wake anyone up. I have complaints. What are you making all those goofy noises for? Whatever. Whatever it is. Just keep it down, miss. Why is it, why is your eyes all red? Mention the coffee machine. I was drugged. Are you messing with me? We don't have no coffee machine here. It's right over there. Okay, here. I've had enough of you crazy goons here for once. I thought we had a sober guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. Follow me. I hate my job, Lee Joe. Oh, let me close my door first. Follow me. Follow me, bro. Follow me. It's right over here. Oh, God, my eye is red. Still following me, bro? Follow. Fo Motherfuck. I'm one of those crazy bitches. There, there was... Okay, there was a coffee machine here, but I don't know where it is now. Where is it now? Go back to the room. Swear to God, it was right here. I said go back now. Okay. Okay. There should be some medication in your room that should offer you some relief. Check the table by the TV. Well, that's nice, I guess. But I swear to God, there was a fucking coffee machine. I swear to God. You're fucking messing with me, bro. Where the fuck did you go? Bro. This place is fucking weird, bro. It's like one of my fears. Where? I, I can't fucking see. There is no light. Nope, not Superman. Is it under here? Ah, uh, medication. Requires water. From the sink. I didn't have bougie shit, so we got from the sink. Okay. Just chilling. Drinking some water. Getting some medication. It's all good. Oh, you know, my eyes are better. Now I can go back to sleep. What the hell's going on? My eyes back to being red. What? Who is it? 
please open the door. I need help. What do you want? I need your help. Please. Please open the door. I know you're in there. the fuck Bro, I don't know. Bro, I don't know. Please leave. I just need to talk to you. I swear, I'm not a cop. Please go away or I'm calling the cops. Pretty- Ooh. The day I finally went, if the day, this is today, to this day, I find it really weird that the manager interfered not to get police involved as would have affected Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult of drug ring, of, or a drug ring, it could possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived with the car after I felt like a year. After we went, went like a long trips again, or long road trips again, I would always take airplanes. Survivor, survive through the second episode. Sorry if I was quiet and everything, I had to be quiet or else I would have gotten caught. 
And if you heard me talking to someone, that was my brother. He was getting his dog and everything. He was getting his dog. Because the, they came down and everything. So they were grabbing to grab his, he was having to grab his dog. So I was telling him to be quiet because I did not want to die. So I was, oof. Very skeptical about that one. That was, that was, that was really weird. Is she going to close out of the game or what's going to happen? Is she going to take me back to the home screen? All right, well, that was Fears to Fathom, Episode 2. I just closed out of the game and everything. But yeah, that was Fears to Fathom, Episode 2. So, yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed that video. That was, uh, that, was, that was a weird one, but I really liked that. All right, so hopefully you all enjoyed If you hear things in the background, like an alarm or something, or if you don't see it, sounds like, it sounds like a bird squawking, uh, it's not. It's an alarm. So, yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed. Um, hope you all, to see you all in the next video of the Fears to Fathom series because we got two more to go through so yeah plus actually actually three more to go to because we have episode five and everything coming out but right now as of right now we have two more to go to so but we actually have three more to go through but two more basically but yeah whatever that was a, that was a long one and i really liked it so yeah hopefully you all enjoyed and peace demons out goodbye